Um, I try to make sure my students taste, 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 taste. Um, I should go through a thousand spoons a week in my classes by tasting that much. And I like to tell the students there's two trash cans in my classroom. If you don't like something, spit it out. You're paying a lot of money to come to the school to eat. You know, like next week we're doing veal heart. No, like, oh my God, veal heart. I don't tell the cafeteria we do veal heart and they eat it all. They're like, oh my God, it's so good. I'm like, I didn't know you like veal heart. That's what I try to get across to the students is, I don't care if you don't like it, you gotta taste it in order to, it's your job, it's your career, you know, and your palate. If you don't have your palate, you can't be a chef. So it's the most important tool that you have. And, you know, they always joke that my two favorite ingredients are bacon and salt. Well, without salt, you have no flavor, you know? They always joke me too, they say, uh, what's the, next, the second step that we should do? Because the first step is regular bacon fat. And, you know, it's, it's all about flavor. You know, when I was in culinary school, when I was 18 years old, the chef, first day of class, wrote a little boogie on a board, fat equals flavor. And it's true.